Hello, Raising Wellness family, and welcome to this brand new video. In this video, I'll be talking to you guys all about the purpose of prayer in your life, to calm your stress levels down, to heighten your ability to manifest, and to just feel overall better in your life purpose. Number one, the first purpose of prayer is to surrender and to come to this space of knowing that there is a higher guidance. There is this higher collective consciousness, this higher vibration, universe, God, Buddha, whatever you want to call it yourself, that is helping to guide your life, that is allowing you to surrender your life to and to move forward from a place of knowing that you are safe, knowing that wherever you are in your journey is exactly where you're supposed to be and that this loving guiding light is always here with you. It is always helping you and sometimes when we are in that state of needing to control something, needing to have a certain outcome, feeling lost, feeling confused, not knowing which way to turn, it's really easy to get into that stressed out mind. But when we come into prayer, it's easy to ground ourselves down, to center ourselves, knowing that we are always guided, that we are loved, and that we are protected wherever we are on our journeys. Number two to calm that stressed and fearful mind. A lot of times when we find ourselves most times going to prayer when we feel like we have no control. You know, there are a select few people who pray every single day. Um, but a lot of times we find ourselves going to prayer when it is our last resort, when we have no place left to go. And I urge you to use prayer on a daily basis, not just in those moments where you feel like you have no control and are completely lost. Instead, use prayer every single day to help you stay above those fearful mindsets, to help you stay above that space of feeling like you're always out of control. Prayer is there to help you de-stress, to surrender, remember, and to just come back into your center, into your alignment, and move forward from that space rather than from a space of fear and hesitation or resistance or loss of control. And number three is to give you hope and belief again. It is so easy for us to forget, so easy for us to stop believing in our dreams and our wishes and our goals. It's so easy for us to stop believing that those things are coming to us. I know in my daily life I have to remind myself every single day that the work that I'm putting in to grow this channel is going in the direction that I hope for it to go. Every single day I have to pray because there is so much that I cannot control. Every single day I have to pray and remind myself and stay grounded right here and now knowing that there is this higher force and higher vibration that is helping me reach the people that need to be reached. And that is what prayer can do for you. It can help remind you. It can give you hope. It can, again, reinstate that feeling of belief in yourself, belief in your dreams and goals. So use prayer to help you with these three things, to really feel grounded and connected to really feel centered in your dreams and your wishes and your goals and your aspirations. Allow prayer to help you again feel guided, guided by love, supported by love. And before we wrap up this video, I just want to end with a little lesson in prayer, how to go about it. because. So many times in our affirmations, in our ways of manifesting, in our ways of praying, or asking for things that we want, or wishing for things to stop that we don't want, or that we're fearful of, right? If you find yourself doing that most times in your prayers, you know, wishing for what you don't have, 
or being afraid of what you do have and saying you don't want it, then listen here. When you pray, start off first with gratitude for everything that is in your life. Everything that is here right now. Good, bad, ugly, sad, things that make you scared, things that make you happy, all of it. Give gratitude for it because every single thing in your life is a lesson for you to learn from. Every single thing in your life, if you do not resist it, is something that you can grow from. Start your prayers first with gratitude for exactly what is here and now. And from that space of gratitude, from that space of love, just ask to see things more clearly. Your body, your mind, your soul, it knows what to do, but sometimes our thoughts get crazy and we can't see things clearly. So surrendering to whatever that higher power is that you believe in and praying with a grateful heart and praying to see things more clearly. is really, truly what's going to help you guide your life more fully with more connection, with more passion, with more love. So whenever you pray, gratitude first and foremost. And second, just ask to see things more clearly. Because sometimes it just gets messy up here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a really quick video but it's super important information. If you are looking for a community of people to rise up together, to pray with, to work on your gratitude, to help point your ship in the direction that you want to go, then don't forget to join the Raising Wellness community over here on our Facebook page. It's a growing collective of people over there sharing in meditation, in mindfulness, in gratitude, in prayer, in goal setting, and goal achieving. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a like, hit that subscribe button, maybe hit that bell so you can see more videos from me. I do all things with mindfulness, meditations, moon meditations, gratitude, all of it. So if you guys enjoyed, I hope to see you in the next video and I'm sending you so much love and so much gratitude wherever you are in the world and I'll see you next time.